so I don't know if you caught that. End of the thread, wrap it around your finger a couple of times so it crosses over, use your thumb to rub the two ends together, pull it down and then you've got a thread at the, a knot at the base of your thread. And then we're going to start with a simple chain stitch, so back of the fabric, pull the needle through, take the needle just behind where the thread has come up and then go just a tiny bit ahead of the thread and then wrap this thread around once clockwise and then pull through and that's your first chain stitch. So again, if you can see it, go back behind the thread that's come up, push it through a little way in front, take the thread around clockwise and then pull it through. There's your second chain stitch. And you just carry on. And then what's really nice about this thread is because it's dip dyed in different colours, it's quite surprising as to what happens when you're sewing. You don't know what colours are going to appear. So it's starting off blue and then eventually it's going to fade up to the purple and then gradually turn into yellow if I if I manage to get that far. And then you just keep going. Okay, so that's what's happened here. You've got different colours are appearing and I'll show you how I did those leaves. In another tutorial okay so I'll just carry on with that and then I'll see you in a bit and we'll do the applique what sort of stitches I'm going to do on that 